Hi guys, Dr. Pelto. Um, you might be wondering if you use nail polish on your toenails, why in the world does it get white after you wear that nail polish? That's what I'm going to go over today. So what you see here is a, a white on the nail right here after taking off the nail polish. Here's kind of another example of some whiteness on these toenails. Um, you might be wondering why this happens. Well, what happens is when you na wear a nail polish for a long time, I have a lot of patients, they wear it all throughout the summer and all throughout the winter. And when they take it off, <laughs> excuse me, they take it off, they're wondering, oh no, what happened? Because they've been wearing it forever. They come to see me and they see all this white on there. White might be the beginning of a, of a nail fungus, which is a superficial white onychomycosis. That's just a big name for a little bit of fungus that's starting. Okay. Uh, so what are some options for this? Well, if you can take it and just scrape it off or buff it off with a buffing pad or a little curette, that means it's really just on the top surface. You don't have to be too worried. Um, there are some other types of nail polishes that can work. So on, on Amazon, I'm going to put a little link here. One is called Dr. Remedy, and I'm going to put a link underneath it. That's one that's kind of like an antifungal nail polish. And there's also another link to something called Carousel, which might work to get off some of that, that, that white stuff on top. Now, if it's a real bad nail fungus, um, I have a little course on nail fungus I'll kind of put here as well underneath it that you can learn more. Um, but a lot of my patients have these questions. So have you had this on your nails? I'd like you to reply and tell me what worked for you. Okay, thank you. Hi, I'm Dr. Don Pelto. I'd like to welcome you to my YouTube page. And on this page, you're going to find a lot of resources that I've set aside for you if you are my patient or if you're here just learning about your foot condition. I'd like to give you a little tour and share a little bit about what we have to offer on this website. First, I've had it organized by my patient resources. These are resources such as our office newsletter, our webinars that we do, uh, or different types of things I'm providing specifically to patients in the office. Uh, as you scroll down, what you'll see is a section that's called Ask Dr. Pelto. You can submit your own question and I'll answer it in one of these episodes. And then what you'll find are a list of videos based on topic under the foot problems. And at the end, what you're gonna find are, are my books. Put a little link here on the upper right hand corner. If you click that link, you're going to get a link to my website. And on here, you're going to find a list of my books. I want to thank you for visiting drpelto.com on my YouTube page. And I look forward to helping you or educating you with this information.